Hello, Gonzo. How's my videographer today? I quit. You quit. You tried to quit, but you couldn't quit. I quit every day. All right. We're gonna make a little. Uh... Oh, you didn't bring the cold spray. You didn't tell me. You're mean. Okay. Uh, a little injection. Okay. Okay. All right. Ready? Stick a sting and a burn. Tell them that in Spanish. Le va, le va a arder tantito. Le va a picar, arder, y va a quemar tantito, okay? I'm going to get griped out about this. All right, stick. Perdón. Sting. Little burn. What we have here is just a non-infected sebaceous cyst. And uh, we're going to do a quick office procedure and remove this. It's not very large, but my patient here Perdón. was referred to me. Uh, because he has this and he wants to get it removed. He's had it for, he said, five or six years, right? Cinco y seis años, see? Sí? Yeah. Alto, pequeñito, pero está grande, eh? He said it used to be small, but now it's big. Now it's bigger. That's what they do. Es lo que hacen. Y esta vez me da mucha comezón, por eso que estaba rojo. He says it gets very itchy, that's why it's red. Mm -hmm. I bet it gets worse in the summertime, right? Se le hace peor en el, en el verano. Pues no, casi es igual. It's about the same. Not the same. Yo le enseñé a la doctora Joana y ya me dice. Me dio la cita para acá para el doctor. Yo aquí soy cliente como 24 años, más o menos. He says he's been a patient here for 24 years. Oh, no kidding, really? Mm hmm. Okay, we're going to make a little incision. The anesthesia we used was uh, lidocaine. It did have a little epinephrine in it, so it should help control bleeding. Just tell them, uh, if it hurts, you say something, okay? Me duele, uh... Diga algo. No, no, no duele nada. Okay, no pain, good. Okay. She says you can take about 10 pounds of fat or meat oh, out of hand. Oh, that's mean. <laughs> that is mean. See, she says just a little bit. Just a little bit. So we're trying to separate the sac from the surrounding skin. We don't want to dig into the sac because then we just end up with this dry sebum everywhere. So today is the 2nd second, second of January. Prospero años y felicidades. Right? How was that? Not bad. That's good. Is it good? We have a lot of scar tissue in here. A lot of fibrous scar tissue. Yeah, that's what happens when these things have been around a long time. It probably looked like a pimple for a while. <laughs> a lot of tamales, huh? She wants to make tamales with it. That is just really going to make me sick. <laughs> <laughs> hey, at least this video will be funny. Well, I guess so. Shadow is making the video dark. I'm sorry. I'm trying to get in here. There's a lot of scar tissue in there. So we're going to work on that. Any pain? I dolor? No. Muy, no dolor. Casi nada. Muy bien. Okay. I'm going to work on the back here a little bit. 
You think I hurt your cell phone, Gonzo? No. My cell phone's not on me. It never is. Mm -hmm. See, it's hers. Next procedure, can I do it? No. Not me. But you know what you can do? You can do the video. Oh, wait, you already do that, don't you? And I start charging. Okay. Double, double you, fee. You can, you can charge me all you want. I don't know if you're going to pay. <laughs> I don't, I don't know if that's the case, so, so to speak. Yeah, we're getting, we're getting pieces of the capsule out here. We're also getting a lot of this dried sebum coming out. Look at that. That right there is a side right there. That's what we, what everybody refers to as the capsule or the sack. And unfortunately, these things don't always just come out in one piece. I end up having to take them out in, you know, piecemeal. Are you hot or is it just me? It's hot. It's a little warm in here, isn't it? Hi, Delore? No. No pain, okay. A Texans fan? I'm fanatic of the football American, the Los Texans. Muy poco. Little bit. A little bit. See, so yeah. like the the uh, soccer, the soccer yeah. football. Yeah. Yeah, I like soccer. Soccer, basketball. Oh, Bocky, basketball. Okay, for the baseball. A little bit of baseball too. Yeah, like the Astros. Yeah. I think they're like the worst baseball team in the national, in the big leagues, Major League Baseball. The <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Spanish for sports is it deportes? Deportes, yeah. Deportes. Si a mi hijo le dan a veces tickets para los astros o para el fútbol americano y nos vamos a ver el partido. Yeah, sometimes get tickets so they get to go see the football and soccer games and stuff yeah. like that. Mm -hmm. We're just dissecting this little capsule out. In our country, there's a lot of soccer. Lots of soccer, huh? In our country, there's a lot of soccer. Football. See, soccer is real football, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Worldwide, that's real football worldwide. There are many players there to play in Mexico. Mm -hmm. It's a good one. Ecuador. Okay. Any pain? No. No? You're doing great. <laughs> She's mean. You have a mean esposo. <laughs> esposa. Esposa. Well, she says that it doesn't hurt. Yeah, she's not feeling a thing, is she? <laughs> no. No. Not even him. Am I in the way? Well, that's just the way that's gotta be. It's gonna be our longest video. You think so? Well, if it is, it is. We'll break it up into two videos if we have to. All right. I'm getting a little hand cramp. I may have to switch over to a hemostat on this one. My hairy hands are coming. Oh, be nice to my hairy hands. 
<laughs> what you're hearing is the scar tissue being cut. So you're removing the scar tissue? Is that what you're doing? Well, the scar tissue just is part of what forms this uh, sac or capsule around the lesion. And see, what I've done is I've got them clamped onto the sac. It feels very little. Okay, you should feel some tugging maybe. Oh, did you feel something there? Okay, okay. Lo siento. Well, you know, you have to kind of pull and you tug and push and Well, tell him, I think we really aren't going to have much of a chance that this is ever going to come back and bother him again. Dice que va a tener muchas chances de que no regrese esto. Ya acabo. 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 What are we having for lunch today? I'm going shopping. Really? Yeah. You're not going to be hungry? Um, uh, I'll get something over the mall. Oh, you're going to the mall? Mm-hmm. I'm taking your wallet. That's okay. There's nothing in it. No, we have a credit card, so I'll take that. Well, there we go. We got the sack. <laughs> Is she hungry? She says that's a pound of meat. <laughs> <laughs> I like her. She's very funny. Okay, so now all we have here is uh, an oh. open wound. And we'll just make sure there's nothing in here anywhere. That's all nice and clean. Okay, so let's put in a couple of stitches and we're going to be done. I'm going to put some puntadas here. And with this, we don't have to do anything. What? No, it doesn't affect any food that is for this. He's hungry. He says, is this affecting you of his uh, eating? <laughs> 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 Do you have to get in a diet or anything like that? No, nothing like that. Why says he's shaking a diet for a year? <laughs> Why does he have to get in a diet for a year? No. No, no diet necessary. Okay, well. Okay, well. No, mi mujer ya quiere ponerme a dieta. Mira, que diga que sí, para no darle de comer. She says you should say yes, so she doesn't have to feed him. She's just being mean, isn't she? Dice que está haciendo bien mala. Es que come mucho. Es que sí, eats a lot. No, sí.
How long does he have to live with a stitch on? Uh, just come in next week and take it out for him. Friday week? That's right, it's Friday, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, it's Friday. El otro, en una semana regresa para que le quiten las puntadas. Oh, está bien. So, el, para el otro viernes. ¿Para pa hacer la poema o tiene que hacer? Uh, tiene sí, que ser cuando bien. salga. Mm. Nomás díganle al muchacho oh, para yeah. una cita para el viernes. Ah, ya está bien, sí. Mm. Okay, so we're going to put a little dressing on this. This may ooze a little bit today. Don't worry about it. That's normal. Okay. He's very brave. Tell me, ask him if it's hurting. ¿Le duele? No. Good. No pain. She wants to know if he'll be normal. No, he'll never be normal. Because he's a man. Dice que nunca ser normal porque es hombre. He's an hombre. Okay. Good work. We're done. Stay tuned for the Meta 7 video. I took mine. How about you? Coconut loves Meta 7, okay? Why? Because look, I could not get comfortable for anything last night. I went to sleep at one o'clock this morning, woke myself up around five, and I have been knocking patients out all day nonstop, and I still have a whole mess of energy. Thank you, Dr. Gilmore, for making Meta 7. Okay, so you took Meta 7 this morning. Yeah, and I take it every just, morning. You take it every morning. And so even though you had a hard time sleeping last night, you took medicine this morning and now you are a medical assistant machine. I am a machine. I'm a tank. <laughs> are your nails and skin looking dry from the summer heat? Does your hair seem brittle and unhealthy? Well, maybe it's time to check out Coco Skin Plus. Coco Skin Plus is a custom blend designed specifically by Dr. Gilmore to restore your hair's shine, protect your skin from the elements, and make your nails strong and healthy. Let's hear from a few of Dr. G's fans. I started taking Coco Skin Plus about six months ago, and since then I've noticed a huge difference in my skin. It's softer, my hair is softer, and it's grown so long. I don't know if you want to zoom in. My nails have definitely gotten stronger, and finally my hair is actually looking normal. Thanks to this, actually. Now available on Amazon with a dramatic price cut, Coco Skin Plus is only 50 cents a day. So stop waiting, order now, and experience the results you've always wanted. There's an Amazon link in the description.